Speaking um, of new music. What you got? We got that Sour Candy song from Lady Gaga and Blackpink. Yeah, she just, she released a whole album finally, right? Yeah, I think she released a whole album. I, I haven't listened to the whole album. I just listened to the one song just because I happened to see it in one of my feeds. It was trending on, I think, Twitter or something like that. That's good. There's been a lot of, uh, I know, I think last week is when Lady Gaga and Ariana Grande released um, their song, like as a single, and then that just took off. I don't know what the final thing of it was, but it had hella views and plays, yeah. but I don't remember yeah. what it was called, Rain On Me, I think. Something like that. No, she's definitely, yeah. she's gone a very promotional, I don't know, promotional, a very interesting route with the album with a lot of her collaborations. Because, like, she went from Ariana Grande to Blackpink. Mm-hmm. And it's like, okay, this is interesting. It's our candy yeah, song. Well, I mean, is actually a really good song, too. I listened to that one at least. That's good. Yeah, I'm looking at her YouTube. There's So, Rain On Me with Ariana Grande has 63 million. Um, it's been out for a week. Um, the album came out, Blackpink... Sour Candy song has 31 million already in two days. Well, Blackpink's um, one of the groups that has broken the 24 hour uh, view uh, record. Yeah. I mean, they're, they're a great group. Like, they're a very talented group of ladies. So, I, I don't like, I don't doubt any, any success they're like coming their way. Um, yeah. But I'm trying to look at the, I want to bring up the album. I see Elton John is on the album too, which is really cool. Uh, I didn't see that. That's really interesting. Um, Let's see who else is on here. Oh, that's it. Cool. It's just those three, those three features on the album. (laughs) That's really funny. Some pretty significant features though. Yeah, for sure. I mean, those are those are big. Especially with Sour Candy, like, at least half the song is just Blackpink. And then the other oh, half is... Oh, is it? Yeah, it's like, it's it's an even, like, cut between Lay Gaga and then Blackpink collectively. Interesting. And it's really cool. So. Yeah, I just, I, I just started playing it. It sounds really good. <laughs> That's cool. Yeah, I need to listen to the whole album. Um, might do a review on that for this week, but there you go. we'll see what happens there. What else you got in new music? My uh, my shit was last week. So. Yeah, your shit was last week. Um, August D's mixtape was last week. Uh, let's see. I don't think there was a. What else was there? Let me my spotify real quick and just be like oh well see usually we would (laughs) we would know this kind of thing but uh someone didn't do any blogs this week it was me um Uh (laughs) uh-huh so yeah i think besides her though there wasn't really much of anything i know um two rappers that i'm into joel ortiz and king crooked released their joint album this week uh, um, I still need to listen to that. The two singles they put out were like, they were fucking good. Really, mm-hmm. really good. Um, Black put out a single. Not really seeing much of anything else. Yeah, a little, a little bit sparse this week. Oh, that's more rap. Uh, Freddie Gibbs and Tyler the Creator put out a new song. Actually, a new album? Yeah, a new album. Cool. I didn't I didn't even realize that. I didn't even go listen to that, too. Fuck, there's so much to listen to, actually. <laughs> Who knew? We should have been known, but, you know? <laughs> someone was just being a slacker this week. Right, someone was... Was chasing waterfalls <laughs> <laughs> and drinking ten dollar fucking Jack and Coke slushies. <laughs> Those <laughs> so fucking expensive, bro. 
I hope I don't have to spend that much on a drink whenever I mess with my birthday plans. That's coming up soon. Yeah, two weeks. What, what are you wanting to do? June the 13th. Um, so I really want to go do some axe throwing. And that's just kind of like, oh, hey, let's go do some axe throwing and then be done in like an hour. Yeah. But I'm thinking about taking a bit of a trip myself. <sighs> I'm thinking maybe South Padre. That'd be really cool. It's a good trip. Be a good trip. What's up? I mean, that's that's what that's like an eight hour drive from where you are. I thought it was about six. Okay. Yeah, that's it fair. Could, it could be eight. I don't know. I'll cut the time. You know, short. you know what you could do is is do an eight hour drive and go to like Destin or somewhere West Florida. Or even like even like Alabama has good beaches. Dude, I could nice. just go straight up and go to Florida. They have I nice have some, beaches there. I have some friends over there too. They're probably all rioting and stuff, but you know. I don't think they are. They're not really into that. <laughs> yeah, not over there. But <laughs> well, I just meant friends. Florida in general. <laughs> not my friends in specific. For sure, yeah. They are they're but. stuck at home playing WoW. <laughs> you know that's not a bad option they're doing think, raids instead yeah they're doing raids instead of uh riots jesus <laughs> did not mean to get into a touchy subject um <laughs> <laughs> anyway yeah no I, i'm planning on doing something i don't quite know what i need to figure that out this weekend so i can put in time because i don't know how many days i want to take off to do so yeah, I'm almost feeling the whole week, but that would be a lot of my PTO time. Yeah, I know. I'm like, but I don't get sick, so it really doesn't matter. <laughs> <laughs> so I think you get sick a lot, actually. It's all stomach viruses, and I can usually just deal with those. It's, it, it's still more than anyone else I know, which is kind of an issue. <laughs> it's only stomach viruses, and I can deal with those. <laughs> <laughs> Besides that, I really don't get sick. And I think stomach viruses, I'm, I'm starting to come up with a solution to that, so it should be fine. Eating better. Yeah. <laughs> well, I'm doing a bit of a cleanse. That's good. Which is actually very needed. That's good, yeah. It was super fun. The, um, it's like, I'm, I'm ready to start going to the beach and shit, obviously safely, like staying away from people and everything, but, uh. It's fucking summer. It's hot. We live in Texas. I need water around my body at all times. Like, <laughs> I'm not, I'm not ready to just die in the fucking house. In the heat. I don't want to spend a million dollars on AC. Yeah, it sucks. But yeah, no <laughs> summer, dude. I'm like, I think I'm gonna plan two more trips this summer. Damn. Yeah, I want to go to Arizona again, and. Maybe Colorado. I don't know. I know I'll probably be to the beach a couple times. Yeah. But I definitely want to go and trip out some more instead of just, oh, hey, what's nearby in Texas? Yeah, for sure. Because I haven't seen all these other places that you have. I've barely... Any trips that I've done vacation-wise has been to Gatlinburg or Florida. Yeah. And that has been it. yeah, you gotta go. At least you've like lived in other places still. Like you've lived True. in Indiana and whatnot. Indiana and Iowa, but those places it was it was corn and farmland and factories. That's all that was around there, honestly. Yeah, there wasn't anything interesting. True. But yeah, I don't know. It'd be cool. I want to go. I do want to go to Vegas actually. Maybe when I go to Arizona, I'll do that too. But <laughs> I just like Vegas, dude. It's so fucking pretty. Like there's like. Just so much to do and just don't bring money with you. Well, yeah, I mean that's the that's the issue, right? <laughs> <laughs> no, if I ever if I ever go gambling, I take like fifty bucks and that's it. Like for I'll that, leave your, I'll leave your wallet at the uh, hotel. Yeah, I I just look at it like it's the same money I would spend on like like uh, fast food, like some other type of three times or some shit. Yeah, so it's like. If I'm going to spend it anyway, might as well just, like, have a little fun with it. Yeah, yeah, that's fair. But, 
It's not a big deal. And it's not like I go gambling ever. Like, I've been gambling twice in my entire life, so. I don't think I ever gambled. And one was on a cruise, too. <laughs> I've never been on a cruise, either. Oh, you should do that, actually. <laughs> Eventually. As soon as, like, the, the risk of it right now is, like, you go on a cruise and then come back and be stuck at port for two weeks because they're quarantining you. Like, yeah, I'm gonna have to wait till some of this cut dies down. Even though the virus isn't real, but it's like whatever. <laughs> <laughs> God, <laughs> it's crazy. There was a. Re- no, I don't want to talk about that. Never mind. Um, 